Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Ghost of a Tale. I'm Paul of Thebes. <gasps> Excellent. Where does this go? Any chance to the well? Maybe we should put a light on the subject. Did we miss anything as we came in? Mushrooms? The edible variety? <gasps> I think it is the well. No? Where's this? I don't believe it! Oh, that's handy. Huh. What are we daytime? Yeah. You again. What is it? I need to speak with the commander. Go on in. Ooh. Okay, this is all you. Oh, look at this. Look at this place, man. <gasps> I feel like having a pooch around. Can I have a pooch around before I go to open? Let's have a little pooch around. Should I use me red mist? find anything useful. Oh look, it's way in this way. Will it be so bold? Any sticks or something? Uh -huh. I'm just getting into your bedroom. If you don't mind. Have a look before I even talk to you. Hair hairbrush. Could it come in useful to someone? Who knows? King's pantaloons. Ooh. King, this costume is based upon the ceremonial garb of King Noor, the great warrior king of legend. In triptychs illustrating his life, King Noor is always seen with a golden crown, a flowing white beard, a magnificent beaded tunic, a regal pair of pantaloons, which I've just found, and a fine pair of stockings and shoes. Well, now, I beg your pardon. Who says we weren't going to find anything nice in here? There's nothing of interest in here. Is this his writing desk? Can we not climb up? No. Oh, we can walk up the other side. How oh, delicious. There's nothing on the table. We can't use this quill. Oh. He had not use it for his bucket. Oh, no. The buckets. Buckets. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Can we reach the quill and ink? No. Okay. We'll jump up on the bed. Open the shutter. Oh, he's a nice view. How did he get such a nice view? Let's not sleep in his bed. Shall we check his chamber pot? Will we look out here before we engage him? And he's over by the fire. So we look around. Ooh, coastal status report. I have to have a look at that. Did we look at um oh, a few other things? Let's have a look at the pantaloons. The pantaloons are the perfect size for a mouse. It's fortunate the garrison commander wears his clothes so tight. <laughs> ah, excellent. In the books. Oh, oh yes, the commander's orders. We never looked at those. The commander's orders. The orders are sealed. Well, we did. Yeah. Hmm. Well, we didn't really, but they were shown to us by Silas. Coastal status report. A report compiled monthly by the Red Paw, detailing the present security status of each settlement or port along various southeastern shore. And then the hairbrush and the other thing Silas gave us. A well-used hairbrush. 
A hairbrush bearing the monogram of the garrison commander. Hmm, could be worth something, huh? A silver coin. The coin's face is adorned with ornate symbols. They appear to form part of a phrase with the language is unfamiliar to you. Right, sir. Don't mind me, Commander. I'm just having incident log. Aha! I was wondering where this was. Private Hearth, given two days in the jail for not wearing his full armor in the courtyard. Private Enga, struck and brained by falling drawbridge after winch break failed, mechanism still unstable. Private Gaff, left addled by a falling barrel. See, this this in was this piece incident log was in, on the table beside the bridge, the drawbridge. That's how I knew in the first time to get it. Ooh, yeah. Mechanism is a bit wonky. Private Gaff led, left addled by a falling barrel. Oh, yeah. <coughs> Private, is it Yule? Fuel? It would be fuel, that's an F. Wagered two florins, he could jump the pit. Funeral to be held tomorrow. Private Scree, taken by spiders in the lower levels. Private Pakov slipped and fell on a broken jar of snail slime. Private Snorl, drunk on duty, assigned to the screaming gate for one week. Private Flack, uh, Flack, I don't know if that's a H or whatever it is at the end. Struck and knocked insensible by a flying bottle. Hm. Private Niels, charged with theft of official documents and remanded to the cell. Hmm. Interesting. Don't mind me, Commander. Nothing here. Just, uh... Just, um... Ooh, you play the harp. Nothing here. Don't mind me, I'm just, just looking around. Alas, poor Yorick. I knew him well. Horatio. Do you mind if I just jump up on your table, have a look at your stuff in plain sight here? <laughs> I say, we've got plenty of armor here. What? Let them be stuck. Why don't you keep nice things here for me? Ooh, ooh. What do, what do, what do, what do? Oh, come on. All these drawers and there's nothing inside. We don't mind me being late. Uh, red mist, red mist. Ooh. What? I'll take the grain. Commander. Wow. He looks, uh, Oh, he's got his pantaloons there, though. Hmm. Should we just have a look around the back of him? Anything else there? Yeah. Nothing. Okay, Commander. It should be interesting, if nothing else. You ready? Ah! Skull, is it? Um. Private Scout, sir, I. You're even smaller than they say. Mm, short and sad, but not encouraged, sorry. Indeed. Welcome, then, to Dear Lane Hides. Uh, thank you, sir. You might be interested to learn that the keep is named for the warrior, warrior Dune Lane. Dune Lane, even. Hero of the War of the Green Flame. And I'm proud to say, an ancestor of mine. You're a descendant of the hero of Dunlan? On my father's side, it's nothing really. It's said that Dunlan himself is laid to rest in the catacombs beneath this keep. And that on a clear, moonlit night, his ghost can be seen still roaming the halls. It keeps haunted, sir? So many have claimed through the years. Strange, in all this time he's never visited me. Is that a loot you're carrying there? Uh, aye, sir, is that a problem? May I see it? Uh, it is quite fragile, sir. 
Of course, I understand. I'm something of a musician myself. Is that so, sir? Aye. We must play together sometime. Now, I have an assignment for you. Me, sir. You, sir. There is something that haunts this garrison, Scow. But nay, tis no ghost, but the shadow of some sinister cabal that looms heavy over it. You're new here, and the only one I can trust. Our jailer, Tyrus Volker, is missing, neither seen nor heard from since the last blood moon. Her journal was found in his chambers. It describes a band of smugglers operating out of this keep led by some miscreant known as the Master. If what's written here is true, it would appear that as many as five members of this garrison are involved. I want you, Scow, to identify these five smugglers. Find out what you, what has become of the jailer, and unmask this so-called Master. This is a delicate business, Scow. I expect to exhibit, uh, expect you to exhibit the utmost discretion. I suggest you begin with your investigation at the forge. I have a feeling the smithy knows most everything that goes on around here. Oh dear. Hmm, should I tell him that yet? Get him on my side? Hmm. And if I fail, and if I fail, I'll have you stripped of your armor and thrown in jail. But I have every faith in you, Scow. Jail, you think he's still in the keep, sir? That is for you to find out, Private. Very good, sir. No, Scow, it's not very good. This will not stand. There's room for only one master of this keep. I'm talking about myself, do you understand? Oh, oh, it was very clear, sir. Good, good. All right, Scow, you're dismissed. You know my door's always open to you. Metaphorically speaking, of course. The garrison's stretched rather thin at the moment, personnel-wise. I can't guarantee I'll always be here in my office. Afternoons, you'll find me down in the harbour master's office. We all have to muck in where we can. <laughs> Our master's officer? Ah, uh, you've not ventured down to the harbor yet. Uh, I believe the west gate is closed at the moment, sir. Of course, the spiders. Well, we'll have to make sure you get the guard or the grand tour at some point. Carry on. Hmm. Scow, what can I do for you? So I'm afraid the jailer is murdered. Murdered? You're certain. I discovered his bottom body at the bottom of a well. You didn't think to say anything. Sir, I found him just before you come here. What evidence have you of this? Mm, here, sir, I have the jailer's obel. Th th this is his blood? Thank you, Scow. Sir, should I continue my investigation into this matter? No, no. Leave it with me, Private. Rest assured, the killer will be brought to justice. Now, I'm grateful, Scow, for your assistance in this matter. I'd like to do something for you in return. What do you have in mind, sir? Well, let's see now. Your armor, Scow, it's rather ill-fitting, isn't it? I mean, you look at you. You can barely walk on it. I can have the smithy make some adjustments, if you like. Shave off some weight. Put down the falls, retail of the greaves, so you can move more freely. Oh, and I should have him brief you about the traps, given all the problems we've, we're having with spiders. One thing at a time, eh? Now. The commander takes a sheet of paper and his quill pen, beginning to write. After signing his name, he folds the paper into thirds and seals it with wax before passing it to you. Take this to the smithy. He'll know what to do with it. Uh, what do you know, sir, about Silas, the signal guard? Sir, I'm still working on a way to uncover the master's identity. Is there anything I can do for you, Commander? I should go... Okay. Silas Wagstaff. Why do you ask? Just pass a part of my inquiry, sir. I'm 
glad to see you're beginning uh, being so thorough. He's a good soldier, conscientious, disciplined, tends to keep to himself. Likes a drink or two now and then. Again, um, you, but <laughs> her mother <us> doesn't. <laughs> he, was, he was demoted a few years back, some incident in the north, if I remember correctly. One curious thing, he requested his transfer to this garrison. Gave up quite a comfortable post, I believe. Is there anything I can do for you, Commander? Play for me, Scow. Play anything. Surprise me. Oh, boy. How come I can't open my songbook now? Oh, let's play from... Let's play Heaven in a Bottle. <laughs> <clears throat> Excuse me. <clears throat> the waves may crash, the ship may sink, and every one of us might drown. But pirates call the sea the drink, so raise a glass as we go down. With thunder crabs will have a tipple. And steal the fish king's pearly cup With shapely mare mice wet a whistle Till top is down and bottom's up I like your choice of song, Scow. Have you ever thought of singing professionally, Scow? On occasion, sir. Don't. <laughs> Bingo! <laughs> well, he told you. Uh, sir, I'm okay. Where to go? Then. Is there anything I can do for you, Commander? Play for me, Scow. Something amusing. Uh, let's not. Uh, perhaps later, sir. Of course, yes. I shall. I shall get on. Mm. Sir, I'm still working on a way to uncover the master's identity. Find some way to gain the trust of the other guards. Find out what they know. Hmm. I should get on with it, sir, with your permission. Of course, of course. Let's have a look at what he gave us. Orders for the smithy. So we can get to move around a little bit faster. The orders are sealed with wax, bearing the stamp of the garrison commander. Let's do it! Let's start with this chap. Can I help you with something, Scow? Forgive me, sir. Farewell. I have to do a whole investigation. I'm going to have a little chat with this guy over here. There's a prisoner on the loose. Keep an eye out for him. Do you know who he is? A mouse. Nobody important. Anything to report? The jailer's turned up dead. I'll stow the well. A better end than he deserved. Anything to report? Something strange. Some scrunt stole Jerob's squad colours. Squad colours? Who'd want a rat's snot rag? <laughs> <laughs> Anything to report? Three checkpoint passes have gone missing. Did you hear? No, I had no idea. Any idea who's responsible? I don't know. Some scrunt. Commander's cancelled all leave for the month because of it. Looks like I'm going to miss my son's birthday again. Anything to report? Let's see. Nothing comes to mind. Anything to report? Let's see. No, all is quiet. Now let's get on. That's me understanding, Captain. It's good to say. You talk? Slow day. I could do with a bit of adventure. Anything to report? Nothing so far. Anything to report? I don't report to you. Let's get on. You're one of those, huh? Fair enough. But anyway. I want to see your snout rag in a minute. 
They're not careful. Might as well go over and talk to this chap. This is great crack. If I'd have known that it was something like that, I thought I would have to, you know, do something that would nearly bring me out of this place that I wouldn't have to uh, come back and let it be left. You didn't see nothing. It wasn't me. Come here. Don't run away. I want to talk to you. Come back. What have you got to report? Escape prisoner still not being found. Stay alert. He could be anywhere. All's quiet. It's been a peaceful afternoon up till now. Oh, I'll take the hint. Oh, Rolo, you're going to be surprised. I haven't shown you my costume yet. Ha! <laughs> Join the red paws, eh? Was there something you needed, Private? Oh, yes. This place is like a maze. Can you help me find my way? Yes, yes, indeedy. Can you help me solve a puzzle? I need a few things. I'm looking for some items clothes. I'm curious about something. I heard talk of a band of smugglers led by the master. Smithy, I have orders for you from the commander. Someone talk about this one. We can't talk about this here. Meet me down on the shore after nightfall. The mouse. Until then, be careful who you talk to about this. All right, then. Was there something more you wanted? Aye. Go ahead, ask. Meet on the shore. That's not a good thing. I uh, might want to get those maps off you, boy. But first, let's get this. Uh, I have orders from you. Is that right? He said you'd know what to do with them. We'd like to tell him what to do with them. <laughs> Blacksmith takes the papers, breaks the seal, and reads. All right, so I can either work on your armor or teach you about the spider traps. Your choice. Oh, boy. I'll take the spider traps over lighter armor, if, if it's a choice. Teach me about the spider traps. Well, now, we can teach you how to spot a hidden trap so you don't fall into one yourself. Please, I want to know how... Blacksmith talks you through his method of detecting hidden traps. We're all done, then. All right, was there something else? Aye. Go ahead, ask. Place is like a maze. Yeah, so myself a puzzle. I need to find a few things. I'm looking for some items because I'm curious about something. Not right now. Yeah, give me more maps. Where is it you're looking for? I can't. Where can I find a way? Okay, I need a map of this place. Can you help me? Never mind. Let's try that. Let's see. Maxman finishes through his belongings and pulls out a roll of tattered papers. All right, here, there, you fancy anything here? You fancy six floors a piece? Map of the catacombs would be nice. You're sure? Certain of it? There you go. Smithy takes the six florins, hands over the map of the catacombs. No. Do you need any other maps? I'll take them all at this stage. Thank you. All right. Smithy takes the six florins, hands over the map. All right, here. I don't mind. Smithy takes the six florins and hands over the map of the shore. Be careful what you're digging up down there. That's the last of the maps. All right then. Was there anything more you wanted? Hi. Go ahead, ask. Uh, can you help me solve a puzzle? No, I don't need that. I need a few things. Can you help me? Is there anything we need? What was it you're looking for? Never mind. It's not important. <laughs> All right. Was there anything else? Uh, yeah. Go ahead, ask. Um, need a few things. I look for some item of clothing. Curious about something. Oh, what's that? Why are you helping me? For two florins, I'll tell you. Go on. Listen. There's not a month goes by without some creature or other trying to escape. Thieves and killers all. Whether they escape or they don't. I still get paid the same, which is next to nothing. So if I can make a little money off it, why not? Anything else I can help you with? Thank you, no. So we've got a whole load to do. Let's have a look at what it says in the catacombs map. A faint network of lines crisscrossed, so it's the same thing. Let's have a look at it. 
Ooh, interesting. Hmm. Very interesting. And there's stuff hidden down there. Excellent. Let's have a look at the others. Harbor, same thing. Uh, okay. Mm hmm. And same again. Ooh. Okay. Head to the west gate. We can still pick up those by the looks of things. So ta speak with the blacksmith. I've done that. Meet the blacksmith on the cliffs. That's, mm, identify the five guards working as smugglers by order of the commander. Smitty bid you meet him on the shore. Unmasking the master. Discover the master's true identity. Track down the master leader of the smuggling ring by order of the commander. Alrighty. Wow. I guess we do the catacombs. Next episode. Thanks for watching. Bye.